CFTR modulators are drugs that help CFTR protein uh, function normally so that it conducts chloride and makes mucus the proper thinness. Until recently, only about 60% of the CF population was eligible to take uh, CFTR modulator therapy. With the approval of triple combination CFTR modulator therapy, we should be able to treat upwards of 90% of the CF population. Triple combination modulator therapy is made up of three separate drugs, each of which restores CFTR function in slightly different ways, but together uh, complement each other's activity. In clinical trials of triple combination CFTR modulator therapy, we saw improvements in lung function, reduction in the risk of pulmonary exacerbation, and reduced symptoms in clinical trial participants. These improvements were seen in individuals with one or two copies of the most common CFTR mutation, f 508 del it is important to have other CFTR modulator options available because we know that individuals with CF respond differently to these medications. Another modulator class that's on the horizon is called an amplifier. Amplifiers increase the amount of CFTR protein in the cell. With more CFTR protein in the cell, other modulators should be able to have a more powerful effect. Hopefully we will see that there will be a range of CFTR modulator options for individuals with CF so that they can have a customized uh, treatment regimen. There will be several trials uh, in the coming year, the first of which is Simplify, a uh, study of treatment simplification in individuals taking triple combination CFTR modulator therapy. We will assess the effect of withdrawing hypertonic saline or Dornase alpha on lung function. We are studying treatment simplification because we have observed that triple combination CFTR modulator therapy has led to health benefits that make us question the need for time-consuming and burdensome therapies. The goal of the PROMISE study is to evaluate uh, outcomes of triple combination CFTR modulator use on uh, other organ systems, including the sinuses and the gastrointestinal tract. We hope to better understand how CFTR modulators affect overall health as opposed to focusing on lung function and exacerbations. BEGIN is going to be an observational study evaluating the effects of triple combination modulator therapy in the very young uh, CF population as, as young as five months. Moving CFTR modulator use into younger age groups will hopefully prevent damage to organs in the first place. In children who have used Ivacaftor, we have seen improvements in pancreatic function. We hope to see the same uh, improvements in pancreatic function in patients who use triple combination modulator therapy. This is a very exciting time to be involved in medical research, and it's particularly rewarding to be able to improve the lives of individuals with CF so dramatically as we can now.